6.30. We just walked up to Nansan. Hi, Haku. He loves it here a lot. So on days where he's not going to daycare, I wake up really early and I walk in here. Sometimes I'll do it twice a day, one super early in the morning and then one at night, but I enjoy it even though it's super early. <laughs> Mandatory grass roll. <laughs> I have to like wet my hair <laughs> so that the perm like can, it's kind of hard to explain. Like when I don't air dry my hair, my perm just kind of falls flat. Running a little behind on time, so I use this Olaplex Bond Smoother. A little late, but I really want some coffee. Oh, annyeong. She showed me how to use your phone number to get a coupon here because I come here all the time. Oh, I Oh, yeah. Oh, Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 잠깐만. 빨간색 수첩을 잃어버려서 잡고 있는데 혹시 못 보셨어요? 친구들 전화번호가 쓰여 있어서 잡고 싶어요. 나 진짜 이런 경험 있어. 어, 너도? 어. 신용카드. 어, 진짜? 찾았어? 못 찾았어. 그냥 취소하고 다른 새로운 거. 어. 어, so, hello. I'm home now. Um, I'm going to go to a cafe, but I wanted to do a little bit of like organizing really quick before I go before I go study. Um, but I want to say thank you so much to Notion for partnering with me on this video. I've actually been using Notion for a while now, like I think about a year now actually, and I really really love it. So I'm very excited that we finally get to work together. So thank you to them and thank you to you guys as always. Um, I'll show you my Notion in a second, but some of you guys might not know what Notion is. So basically it's this tool, it's very multifunctional. So you can use it in team collaborations or like myself, I basically just use it for my own stuff. I use it by myself. But because you can share like work and notes and stuff, it's super useful to use like on team projects. And I know a lot of you guys go to school and go to work. So Notion would be really helpful for that. It's just more productive and it saves time. I personally love it for both those things, but I just use it on my own. Um, that's how I've been using it for like the past like year and a half now. I use it to kind of just manage, schedule, organize some parts of my life. So I actually used to use just a little calendar app on my phone and the notes app on my phone. And although it did get me through tough times, I will say Notion is a lot more productive, useful, and just easier to use and you can do everything in like one place. And because Notion is more customizable than just using like a notes app or a calendar app, you can organize your things, take notes. Uh, you can just do so many things. Let me just show you actually. I just, I love it because you can just do a lot, almost everything in, in one place. Okay, so I'll show you this first. So this is um, on Notion, they have templates. So you can use these templates to kind of organize or take notes or whatever you wanna do. So for example, so this is um, just a little homepage. Uh, you can make recipes, um, what else? Oh yeah, okay, here's a little notebook so you can take notes, 
make grocery lists. Oh, and then look, a task list. I found it especially helpful when I didn't really know where to get started. But actually, basically, I found Notion through this YouTuber called Chris Yu, and her notions are awesome. And um, basically, that's kind of how I discovered and got started, and mine is nowhere as incredible as um, her notions, but mine gets the job done. So I'll show you mine. So to preface, I wanted to keep my notion pretty clean, not too cluttered. Um, so this is my homepage. So basically this is like a calendar. There's a little weather widget at the bottom. Um, and then you can see actually <laughs> there's Oikawa from, I don't know if I'm saying that right, from Haikyuu and then there was Levi at the top. So it's not super, super decorated, but it has two characters that I really like. Um, and then basically this is the calendar under work for, it's, it's called life schedule, but basically I just use it to, um, organize work stuff and not only that like keep track of like upload schedule and any collaborations um, and then also just life stuff um, but then I also keep um, my school calendar separate because I don't like it when my calendar looks too cluttered it definitely doesn't help um, so this is my school calendar and it kind of just is showing what I need to do so any homework tests, quizzes there are, anything to do with school, it goes into this calendar um, because I have exams coming up and I've been organizing it this way. And then I also have a personal tab, not much in here. I'm not gonna go into the finances tab because that's personal. Um, I do keep track of my finances in this section. Um, and then I just started this recipes tab because you guys know I've been trying to cook at home more. So I link, I usually find the recipes on TikTok. So I'll link the TikToks and ingredients and uh, the dish names here. Hopefully I'm gonna fill this out a bit more soon. And actually right now I wanted to create like a little weekly agenda tab in my Notion. So um, I'm going to do that really quick. I'll show you guys um, me like pulling a template too from here. So let me show you guys. So that is kind of gonna be the rough draft of this weekly agenda tab. Um, I've been wanting to make these to kind of organize week by week a bit better. But anyways, you can kind of see like how easy it is to use. But anyways, um, I'm gonna leave a link in the description. If you guys do wanna try out Notion, you can go there, click the link to sign up. I personally do love it. I think you will too, so at least give it a try. Okay, so I'm done with my Notion. Um, so I'm gonna go to a cafe and study with Haku, so. See you later. <laughs> this is his favorite cafe. I am dressed because I think I'm gonna go to the gym tonight, but I'm gonna make dinner really quick. So I'm gonna make tenjang jjigae and another try at the tomato egg. All right, I'm a little confused how I'm supposed to sift, sift this in here. The answer was a bigger sift. Peel my tomatoes. Wow. Okay, so I boiled the tomatoes in water for one minute and then I put them in ice water until they were cold, like cooled down. And it really works. They like peel so much easier. All right, tomato eggs, some rice, microwave, sorry. And then my tenjang gook that I hope is good. 
du, 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 du. Mm. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, that was good. Yo. This is so, it's got like just the perfect amount of kick to it too. Like it's, mm. like it's spicy, mm. but like only kind of comes in at the end. Wow, babe. Okay, try the tomato egg. I thought I'd be healthy today at lunch. Because mm -hmm. it was just like juice looking thing. Mm -hmm. So I got it and it said avocado. That was the only word I could read. <laughs> and I drank it and dude, it was so sweet. I like that. I think it was just like juice, but I guess like they blended an avocado in it. So they called it avocado juice. But it literally just tasted like apple juice with like a little creaminess from avocado. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Mm. It's not a complete mm -hmm. tomato egg, but... I think it's tough with cherry tomatoes. I think mm -hmm. you have to have like the big, thick chunks of tomato. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, this, uh, did you see the title of this episode? Did you? Mm -hmm. Nice. Maybe we'll see them filming it. Oh, they're so happy. Should we go to the places that she goes to in the show? Yeah, let's see where she goes. Yeah. Oh, it's not about the dolphin. Mm -hmm. Oh, new family. Isn't that going to be awkward with the co-worker chef? Well, I guess it's Nico. Oh, she likes that bad guy. Mm, she wants to go. <laughs>